important thing. I was serving in the uh, Iranian military organization under the Shah, and I was sent with a colonel to prepare the quarterly report on modernization of the Iranian armed forces. Suddenly this colonel, or we call them colonel in America, turned towards me and said, uh, I hear you're a Christian. I said, yes, I am. He said, and I hear you're a pastor. I said, yes, I am. He said, uh, have you heard this song? And with a wizened voice, shivering, he started to sing. I'm but a stranger here. Heaven is my home. I said, Colonel, where did you learn that song? He said, oh, long before you were born. I attended an Adventist academy of all the places in my hometown. He said, and we had a dean of men by the name of Olson. He used to take us morning and evening for worship. And this is one of the songs that we learned. Now, I got shocked. In a way, I was very happy to hear that he had had experience with Seventh-day Adventists, but I got very shocked as to why I didn't open up anything with him and waited until that opportunity came for him to open up that story with me. You see, we have to look for opportunities to witness people. And if we use those opportunities, we never know what we'll come up with. Had I opened the subject myself, would have been much better so that he would know that as an Adventist, I like to share something with him. So the lesson of this story is take your opportunity wherever you are, with whoever you are traveling, in the bus, in the train, in the aeroplane, to share your concerns for the person's uh, salvation. And you'll be surprised what the Lord will do out of that contact. Amen. Amen.